good cloudy Tuesday morning to you after the long weekend. I guess it's time to go back to work. But first, taking the puppies out so they can go to the bathroom. They were already out earlier this morning, but they always have to go out a second time. Empty out before a long day of being cooped up inside. Well, not a really long day. We always try and get home a little bit early for them. Right, Willow? Willow's all stretchy. Uh, so far, it looks like it's going to be a good day. Cloudy is good. Hopefully it stays this way, and hopefully it doesn't get all hot and sunny and humid out. I can accept a little bit of humidity for the clouds. Uh, yeah, so this morning, gonna go to work. I forgot to mention that I didn't finish cutting the lawn. So there's like a whole section in the middle here that I didn't finish cutting and I never actually did the weed whacking around the outside. And now it's had another few days to grow and we've had rain and sun. And so now it's due to be cut again. So now the edges in the middle are extra long. So that means I've got some work ahead of me. I'm gonna have to start it tonight when I get home from work. And there's Lucy and Will. They're getting bugged by flies this morning. For some reason, we have a lot of flies out here. And Willow especially. That's Willow in the back there. She hates flies. They really get on her nerves and she gets kind of upset that they bug her. And they're kind of bugging Lucy this morning too. And me, I'm going inside. So I actually have something to record at work this morning. I went next door to us, to Dollar General, one of my least favorite places to shop, but they had what I needed. And in line in front of me to pay was a woman who claimed she was blind and couldn't use the little pad to check out. She couldn't see to swipe her card or to press the buttons on the screen so she had to have the cashier help her and then when the cashier handed her her bag she fumbled to grab the bag and asked if everything was in one bag and then she left out the front door i paid and then when i went outside i noticed her on her own driving away so a blind woman who couldn't swipe her own card was getting in her car and driving away. I think I have a zit on the side of my nose. Hopefully it's not showing up on camera. And if it is, don't look. Uh, I'm just out getting lunch. Work day, work day lunch. I won't tell you what I'm getting because it's not good for me. Uh, but I'll try and make a wise decision when it comes to the menu. Still won't be good for me though. Might taste good though. I don't know. The one I'm getting I haven't tried yet. So we'll see. <sighs> I'm tired. So tired. I need to do something to energize me. Have any suggestions? I know. Don't eat fast food. Hair's all wet. Shirt's all wet. Came home and mowed the lawn. Got the whole thing done and uh, one charge of the battery this time. So I've got it out charging so it'll be ready for the next time. But I only made it halfway through the weed whacking. I don't think even if the battery was charged all the way I could have made it all the way through. Needed a break. All the sweat was going down into my eyes and getting on my glasses. So, I'll let that charge up. And then probably go out once it cools off a little bit and the sun goes down and I'll finish that up. Then we'll be good for a week. Which will be nice. Hopefully it'll cool off in that week. And now I'm just going to sit and relax. Well, I'm going to put laundry and then I'm going to sit and relax. Catch up on some YouTube. Upload some YouTube. Spend some time with the puppies. Vanessa was supposed to go work out at 3. Turns out her workout's not till 4. So, I'll hang out with Vanessa for an hour. 
Here, man, I'm gonna go work out later tonight. This is what you don't want to be doing at 5.30 in the afternoon here in Chandler. Trying to go south on to Alma School across Chandler Boulevard. Because when the light turns green, it lets three cars through and then changes again. I don't know why. So that means everything is backed up for blocks. It's really annoying. Trying to get somewhere. I had what I thought was enough time, but now I'm already late. It's baloney. I'm gonna say bullshit, but we'll clean it up and say baloney. So, I'm out here in the backyard. Vanessa was going to go get a tattoo tonight, but it ended up she had a headache after her workout, so she's not going to get a tattoo. But what am I going to do? I had dinner. I had some California rolls and some Vietnamese salad rolls. So I actually had a pretty healthy dinner. And I was going to finish weed whacking, but it got too dark out. So it's actually night out. Bummer. But I can finish that up tomorrow. And then, uh, That'll be good for the week. What else is going on? Um, I'm not sure. I guess I could edit Monday's vlog and get that up. And I've been wanting to work on some photos that I have from a while back, back in June. So yeah, it's probably time to get those finished and get them up online. And gotta go get the dogs some food because they're probably hungry. And we have none left. They ate it all. Who'd have thunk? What are you two doing? What do you want, Lucy? Tell me what you want. Use your words. Tell me. Use your words. Use your words. Okay, I guess you can have your ball. You want that? Is that what you wanted? And go get it. How about you, Willow? Do you want anything? Willow? Willow? Where's your ball? Was it the wrong ball? Where's the right ball? You didn't like that one. Where's the other one? I don't know where the other one is. Let's go look for it. Just quickly running out to get the dog some food and to brag about my smart Lucy dog. I've never taught her to use her words and I've never encouraged her before to use her words. So it was kind of interesting that I told her to use her words and she did. It's because she's so smart. She knows people talk. It's not just inflection. She actually knows what I'm saying. Because she's smart like that. Willow is too. 
You should hear Willow when she talks. Maybe you will. Maybe you won't. Depends on if she's camera shy or not. Which she kind of is. She doesn't like to have her picture taken. Well, I just went for a little walk from the pet food store over to the people food store. Walking into Bashes is like walking into the 90s. It's what I remember grocery stores looked like in the 90s when I used to go over to Port Huron with my family and shop for cheap American groceries. It's exactly how I remember the Kroger's that we used to go to. It's just like stepping back in time. There's nothing modern about them except for some of the food they have now that they didn't have back then. But other than that, the decor and just the feel of everything, totally 90s. Uh, but what else was I going to say? Oh yeah, I bought a watermelon and I bought some ice cream. Ice cream's for tonight, watermelon's for tomorrow night because I like my watermelon cold. So I'm going to pop it in the fridge and I'm going to go work out tonight. Because the easy thing would be to just eat my ice cream, watch TV, and not go work out. And I'm not going to do the easy thing. I'm going to go work out. So, yeah, I'm still going to eat the ice cream. And I'm probably going to eat ice cream when I get back from working out. But, so be it. I feel like ice cream. And I do feel like working out. So I'm going to. Alright. I did it. I made it to the gym. I did it in ice cream before the gym. But I didn't enjoy it. Uh, so I definitely won't be having one after the gym. I'll see how I'm feeling once I get home, but I might drink some uh, like a protein shake. Uh, but we'll see. Maybe I'll just have some water. Because I do have to go to bed at some point. But it is only 10.37, so I should be home by 11. And then I'll be able to do a little bit of editing. And then I'll be ready for bed. So... I'm going to wrap things up now. I'm going to say good night. And uh, I'll catch you later.